Hello YouTube, it's Silver Edge Dave. It's Thursday, I'm in the comic room feeling great. Today is awesome and uh, I wanted to share some of that awesome with you guys. I recently ordered some uh, some new comic books. These are homage covers and uh, I wanted to share them with you. I, I, frequently you see homage books, sometimes they're good, sometimes they're not. I was pretty impressed with these and uh, as sometimes happens in the world of Silver Age Dave, uh, if there's a spider Gwen on it, I got to jump. Well, these particular books, uh, when they came out, they were priced a little bit high. These came through, no, I don't want to say they were priced high. They were priced out of my budget for these comics. Uh, but there was a spider Gwen on them. They were on my radar. And then Stadium Comics, uh, who, they're, they're an online store. Um, Stadium Comics then brought the price down a little and then they ended up packaging four books together into a package, and that price came down, and that's when I, I jumped on them. So the first one uh, I want to show you is this uh, homage cover right here. Okay, that's the New Mutants 98 Life Field cover homage, and I'll show you that up close and personal. I thought they did a great job on this cover. Uh, this was done by Jamal Campbell. Uh, I think I'm, I'm getting his name right. And it's a uh, after live field cover. You can certainly see the Spider Gwen right here. And um, uh, I like it. I really like it. They even changed, if you notice here, the Captain America uh, from 50 years to 77 years, which is cool. Uh, you know, we those of us old enough, we remember when that 50-year logo came out. So I thought it was neat uh, that, that, you know, so much respect was put into this and thought and and talent really. So I saw this. This was a 3000 print run. Uh, and like I said, I ended up ordering two of them. But uh, Jamal also did another level up. Okay, so often it happens that if you buy at this price, you get this, you pay a little more, you get the better, right? That's what they call it. So what do you get when you go from a 3000 print run to a 1000 print run? Well, I'm going to show you now. Ooh, look at that. You get the New Mutants logo at the top, or the throwback logo. And uh, what you'll notice is that the cover, I'm going to call it bronzed out or, or tonal. Uh, I don't know what to call that. I'm not an artist. I draw a stick figure and people don't know what it is. They're like, look at that pretty flower. So whatever this is called, I thought it was cool. The colors are kind of ominous. And uh, and I just thought he did a terrific job capturing the um, you know the essence of that cover, for lack of a better term. It's a it's an homage cover, but uh, that's what we have. So that's the first issue. I'm going to try to stay to six minutes, so I have to move along, right? So uh, let me put this back here with Deadpool, and then we're going to talk. Well, there's too many of them to put with Deadpool. Deadpool. Uh, is fine, but Gambit's wanting to fall over. All right, so we're going to do that, and we'll stick these up here. I'll stick this other one so we can see that. All right, so then that leads us to X-Men 266. I'm not sure if this is as big a key as it was last year, but it's still a key book. So Jamal, once again, I think he did a great job. I'm going to pull these up here, and I'll pull the 266 back up. We only have two hands in this comic room. So, um, great cover by Andy Kubert. And, uh, and again, I thought Jamal did a great job capturing the essence of the cover. Uh, there's certainly some, some motion uh, that's in there. Great job. I like that we have Enter the Web Slinger here. Super happy. You know, the vines turn into webs, and, uh, and I like it, okay? So, that's our that's our first cover. That's the three thousand print run, and then uh, when you pay just a little bit extra, what you end up with is another bronze or tonal cover. You end up with the X Men logo uh, lettering, which I thought looked super cool on here. And uh, once again, I couldn't be happier. For the money I spent, I bought two sets of these. And, um, you know, I don't know what their current deal is on these, but Stadium Comics did these. Very, very happy. Uh, they do some co cool stuff now and again, and I thought this was cool stuff. So I need to have it in the comic room, and that's where it will stay. Uh, guys, I hope you like them. I'm going to put this back over here. 
We'll see if I can stand one of these up. I don't know if I can. And uh, I'm just going to wish you the best. It's a Thursday. I just passed over the five-minute mark, so my job here is done. I'm going to hand you off. Maybe this will be a Friday morning video. I'm going to hand you off to the greatness that is Friday. Enjoy yourself. Uh, as sports goes, it's the best weekend of the year, in my opinion. I know where I'm going to be camped out tomorrow afternoon is at a BW3s watching some basketball. So hopefully you have a great weekend, whatever you want that to look like. Make it yours and smile a lot. That'll make it even better. Silver Edge Dave is out.